and welcome back. I'm here with Leah Martin with Marion State Bank and Michael Bricker from Life Share Blood Center, our West Monroe, West Washita Chamber of Commerce Member of the Month. So Leah, Michael, thank you so much for joining Thanks. us. Thank you for Great having to have us. you. Yes. Leah, I'm going to start with you first, as yes. always. Why did you pick Life Share as the Member of the Month? Good choice. Well, I mean, it is an amazing organization that does so much for our community. And when I was researching, I saw that September was blood cancer, sickle cell awareness month, so so many great things and we just thought it was the perfect time to highlight them. Absolutely, let's start with sickle cell awareness month. Sure. What message are you getting out to the public? Basically you know, a diverse donor base is how you answer this issue. Mm -hmm. um, the best thing for sickle cell uh, patients is to uh, have blood transfusions regularly. Um, that, of, that often helps with the symptoms of sickle cell. Mm -hmm. um, and so to do that, you've got to have blood and you've got to have a diverse set of blood that will meet the needs of each unique patient. And so um, we, need, we need more donors. Yeah. yeah. And then it's also Donor Awareness Month at the same time. Absolutely. Absolutely. What is LifeShare doing right now with the storm coming into the area? You mentioned that it may impact yes, some of your facilities. Yes, ma'am. So three of our centers in the south are going to be substantially hindered, um, if not completely not collecting blood. Um, hospitals have already started reaching out, you know, making sure they have their um, their needed stockpile of blood. So what basically what we're looking at is, is half of our centers will be a little bit handicapped. So that means that the rest of our centers, Monroe, Shreveport, Texarkana, really have to answer the call. And uh, how can businesses help? You mentioned you wanted to uh, address the help from businesses as well? Sure, well I'll give an example, right? I mean, the obvious way to do it is through partnership with us. Um, it doesn't fit for every business, not every model, really, you know, not asking everybody to do so. Um, but you take Marion State Bank, for example. Two years, four blood drives total, 55 units, 5,500 blood cell units coming in um, to our hospitals and it's on a regular basis. I mean, that's huge. Um, and so that's one easy way to do it. The second way is to help partner with us to, um, let's say Marion's having their, their blood drive, we were right beside them, let's go over and, and yeah. donate on the same day. Or um, let's all throw um, some funds in the pile to incentivize the blood drive. And that's what uh, I was gonna ask yeah. Leah, you know, sure. um, to, to offer incentives as well, that gets more people to give. For sure, he gave a great example of another business owner who um, did a, pizza for yeah. everyone who came and gave. So there's so many things that business owners mm -hmm. could do to incentivize, uh, incentivize others to come sure. and give, um, but also just a, another way of taking care of our community, a selfless servant act of just giving a little little time and a little blood. All right, for more information, call Life Share Blood Center and uh, you can set up a blood drive with your business or you could just go sure. individually and, uh, and give blood. Thank sure. you so much, Michael and Leah, Thanks, for joining Ash. us. Thank it's you, great Ash. to have Absolutely. you. Congratulations. All right. And up next on Louise.